KJ the third and fourth in the red zone with the ball seemed like they caught you off guard. Can you describe what happened there? Uh, I just went on the route and then uh, I guess just a, just a miscommunication or just timing. Uh, I got to go back and watch it, you know, see see what exactly what happened. Um, I said, so I had to go, go watch it. So you, were just, you weren't expecting it or anything like no, that? No, no, I was expecting okay. it, yeah. The, but like, just, uh, like I said, I, I kind of got to go back and watch it. I, gotta, I didn't really get a chance to see it that much. So, so you can see the timing was off on yeah, that? Yeah, just the timing was off, yeah. Just to be at one and four at this point, just how, how tough it, what's that? What is you guys' attitude at one and four? Yeah, I mean, our, our attitude is, you know, we got to keep working, man. I mean, there's, there's, I mean, I don't think we have another choice um, but to continue working. I mean, it's the same story every week. You know, sometimes we shoot ourselves in the foot and, um, you know, it's coming down to a game of inches of, you know, could have made a play here, could have made a play there. So, um, got to get, just get back in the lab. Not really nothing else to it. Did you see what happened to Dustin live? I didn't, know. What was kind of your reaction when you realized he wasn't out there? Uh, I had to uh, move to the X position um, where he usually plays and, uh, you know, just, just try to make some plays. You mentioned shooting yourself in the foot. Is the drops and the turnovers, um, is that particularly eat at you because those are you know, balls that are hitting guys' hands? I mean, uh, really turnovers. When you turn the ball over, especially against a good team like that, um, you know, they're going to make you pay. Okay, how tough is it you guys were right there against the defending Super Bowl champions to not come away with uh, a win there? I mean, um, very tough. You know, it doesn't matter if it was, you know, whoever it was, you know, all these four games. Um, obviously, just, just super tough that, you know, we're in these games. You just got to find a way to finish them. You all had so many wins on games like these last year. What is it like this year, kind of seeing the other end of that? Like I said, it's very frustrating. Um, we got to find a way to just, you know, come out on the other side of them like we, like we used to do. Especially where it comes down to that, that one sequence where Addison drops, I mean, Madison drops the ball, then a delayed game, and then the non-call. How do you keep the frustrations in, in check when you know you can't control what the ref does, right. um, but the balance of the game could hang in there? I mean, you just got to control what you can control. That's just kind of been the story of, of a lot. Um, control what you can control and, you know, uh, battle back and get ready for the next play. Uh, I think TJ was saying, hey, listen, we haven't played any divisional games yet, so we have to stay focused on that. Is it hard to kind of keep the faith on that, or, or how do you process that? No, it's not hard to keep the faith. Like I said, um, well, you know, we're a couple games into the season, but we got a long way ahead. You know, we haven't played any divisional games yet. So, like I said, like he said, you know, we have to buckle down and, you know, get ready for um, these divisional games, and uh, it's, it's a lot still ahead of us.